This is the last week to sign up for Survive the Sound, an online game based on something that's happening right in our own backyard. So if you sign up, you'll get a real glimpse into the challenges our local salmon face just to survive migration. Tim Joyce is here with those details. Hey, Tim. Yeah, we are seven days from migration already. More than 6,000 folks have signed up to play Survive the Sound. It's an interactive game based on science. You pick a fish, join a team like our Q13 News, Sam Q News Fish. The bigger your team, the better your chance to win bragging rights and to learn some stuff at the same time. And then one Watch as your salmon fights to survive the five day migration next week. You have until next Monday to sign up. It's free to join. We've posted a link to our website on q13fox.com slash links. We've also been bringing you updates to news stories on the challenges that endangered fish face in our area. Last week we told you about the fix on the way for the Hood Canal Bridge, hopefully by next spring. The bridge poses a huge threat for migrating salmon. A study from the nonprofit Long Live the King showed that half the juvenile salmon trying to get out to the open ocean that die at this choke point, usually snacked on by seals. The fix will hopefully fix water flow around the bridge to get fish passing through that troublesome area more quickly. You can find out more on that story right now on our website, q13fox.com. And coming up this week, we'll introduce you to a new technology at the Ballard Locks that could give fish a fighting chance to escape, escape seal predation. The new system uses sound in a new way that has not been used before. That's Wednesday morning at 7 and 9 a.m. And again, if you want to sign up your family or your classroom, you can do it this week. It's free to join. Any donations go to support sustainable fishing in our region and restoring wild salmon in their runs. Again, we posted that link to our website, q13fox.com slash links. Survive the Sound kicks off next Monday, May the 3rd.